Welcome ladies and gentlemen, this is the Energy Vibration um, Love Reading for the month of September for the Aquarian, Gemini and Liberans. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for being back. If you would like to pick up these extended readings, they are, um, you can pick them up on my channel, you can become a member and you have to take the super extended in order to pick up these extended readings so so the energy of the super membership is going to be um you can pick up your own private uh, um reading that is going to be um for you individual the occurrence gemini's and liberals have their own extended reading as you become a member of the channel this is going to be helping you um to receive um what is going to be coming out for your individual sign um love reading business reading that sort of readings is done in collective form um because of the sensor of this channel um that's how people become a member okay so wow it is going to be a karmatic situation for the chocolate brown people men and women so um yeah so air sign people especially chocolate brown people um you are going to be dealing with some issues um in the september clearing karmas okay so um these um chocolate brown people um is um the dark men and women okay dark hair people um dark eyes people or any sort of an age difference the men is significance um in this reading okay so this could be you chocolate brown men or it could be uh, um, a significant chocolate brown person that you're dealing with. So let's say that um, you're a man, um, then you're dealing with someone else in a karmatic state. If you're a woman, um, chocolate brown, um, brown eyes, dark hair and brown eyes, you're going to be affected by karmatic relationships in a this month of September, where you're going to be clearing up and healing some sort of a karma um, in a relationship. You could be a Caucasian that is with a chocolate brown person. Um, however, they are going to be affecting your life. It is a karmatic relationship. Karma, all things that have a higher per purpose and are meant to, to be. They are written in the star. Allow destiny to take its course. Sometimes event don't go as, as planned. So a lot of this is going to be affecting you guys. And you have to be open up in order to release, clear these issues and situation that is happening and transpired because they are all karma okay ladies and gentlemen they're all karma these are karmatic situations so wow your foundation is secrecy is coming out if you think that there was some sort of a secret relationship that was going on in your marriage or your relationship it is going to be coming out. So if you weren't tr trusting your partner and that sort of a thing, it is definitely going to be coming out. There is absolutely no question about this. You can see the energy here of the moon, um, the hermit and the sun. So whoever had some sort of a secret affair, secret relationship, um, you know, this is going to be coming out. So this is the basis of, uh, of your reading where there is going to be some sort of a secret relationship secret affair or secret secret uh, marriage relationship so however this is going to come out is 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 definitely it's destined to come out so it's karma um that uh, uh, is happening so let's say you were married and you're finding out that your partner had some sort of a secret relationship or a secret marriage um, or was married before and never told you this sort of a situation is going to be coming out. 
So we are going to be um, looking at the energies that is coming up. So um, we see um, someone, a man is coming in. This man could be wealthy, okay? Whoever this man is, he's coming in, is riding in. And he's going to be offering you love. Okay, so whoever this person is, I see a new man coming in. He's riding in and he's going to be offering a lot of you love. So be aware of this, okay? This man is coming in with his heart wide open. This could be someone who is materialistic to Bill. And he's coming in and he's going to be offering you love. And he's going to be showing up for you. Then we see the energy of some of you are deciding... Um, that you want to open up your life. Maybe you want to have an open relationship because it's as if you are understanding that I am lovable. It's as if some of you are going to be understanding, hey, um, you know, I was in a relationship for so many years and, you know, now I'm realizing I'm lovable. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be opening up. I'm going to be looking for more fishes in the sea. Um, it's as if some of you, your partner has uh, really brutally and mentally just dismiss you that you were not worth, you know, the cause and that sort of a thing. And I see you're going to be realizing, hey, BS, I know I'm lovable and you're going to be open up to love and this is going to be powerful. So wonderful and it's just you're coming in. Then I see some sort of an information is coming in. And the information that is coming in um, is that some of you um, was worried about if your partner was being honest with you. And some sort of a information is going to be coming in and you're going to be finding out that your partner has been not very honest and that your partner was having some sort of a secret affair. And this, this is going to be coming out for a lot of you air signs. So it was as if as some of you air signs... So, um, we're, you know, thinking, hey, um, there's something really going on here and, uh, um, you're feeling as if, yeah, it just doesn't add up with my partner. So you could be living in some place that per person is living some place and they're going to be finding out that something wasn't adding up and you're going to be realizing because truth's information is going to be coming out to alert you, ear sign people that your partner has not been honest and they have been having either an open relationship or they were having some sort of a secret relationship secrets affair then we see the energy that is stopping and the pinnacle of um this month in love is that uh, new love is coming in okay new offers of love is going to be coming in some of you um, someone could be coming in who from the past coming in back to re-collaborate with you. So some sort of a new love is coming in. Some of you, if you were in a relationship with a cancer, you're going to be finding out the truth that a cancer has been lying to you. So air sign people be aware of this and go check out the extended reading. You have to become a member of the channel. There was something with the um, you air sign people and the cancers. So a lot of you who are in relationship with a cancer, you're going to be finding out a lot of lies. Um, that this lie, this cancer is a, is a, um, is a liar. Um, that this cancer has not been honest. And I see truth is going to be coming out about a cancer because light is going to be shed on the lies and deceptiveness of a cancer. And they're going to be finding out the truth of this cancer. So you're going to be finding out really, um, and I think for you guys, this month is all about, uh, um, secrecy over secret relationship and secret affairs, secret, um, secret relationship and secret affairs, um, that you're going to be finding out is as if the universe is going to be bringing this out for you. Then I see some of you who are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion woman. I see some of you want a new start with this person or this person wants a new start with you. So if you were dealing with a Pisces, yeah, 
Um, it is coming up as a cancer woman for some of you, but for, for the rest of you, if you're dealing with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion person, um, I see that a cancer, you're going, some of you are going to be finding out the lies and deceptive death for a cancer, but I see some of you, a new start, you, some of you want a new start with a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman, and I see um, you're hoping for this, so um some of you a new woman is going to be coming in um in your life uh some of you um and then we see um some sort of a situation where some of you are open for new love and this is going to be good so a lot of you are hoping for new love and uh, i see this new love is going to be coming in so um chocolate brown burn eyes people and dark hair people um, you're going through some sort of a karmatic situation with people, but new love it could be coming in where you have end and gone through a cycle with someone and you're leaving that behind and moving forward. Okay. Chocolate brown people, brown eyes people, you could be caught up in some sort of a affair, secret affairs that was happening and transpiring. So be aware of this. Now, when we look at this new man coming in, there is this man. This man is financial stable. He has work. He's coming in and he's going to be offering some of you love. Now, if you are a same sex um, person, this man is coming in. This man is going to be offering some of you love or are you open for this relationship. I see that some of you are hoping it. And you're going to be happy. Okay. So if you decide this new person who is coming in, um, this person is offering you love. And if you are open for this relationship, I see you're going to be very, very happy. Um, and I see you're, you both are going to be working on this relationship in order to bring forward some sort of a balance. And, um, because you both are coming out from, um, this honest relationship, I see you're going to be starting this relationship in, uh, you know, a really honest, uh, honest, uh, uh, honesty, loyalty, and, you know, being responsible for the action and the words, um, that you two have, uh, um, with each other. Then we see a lot of you are going to be finding out, you know, I am worth, um, I am lovable. A lot of you, whatever is happening and transpiring, this is like a lot of you have been beat down um, with your relationship where people have been um, treating you unkindly and you're going to be standing up and said no more, no more. Because you're going to be finding out that you're worthwhile, that there is someone there to, to love you. So a lot of you could be beating up yourself because a relationship did not go well and now you're going to be finding out, you know, I'm better. Some of you who are in a relationship with a cancer, you're definitely going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness of this cancer. And all of a sudden, new love is going to be coming in because it's as if you see the cancer. It's as if you were in a relationship with this person and this person has been playing you for quite, and you saw the person and just out of blues, a new love just popped in. This person could be someone on the work floor. I don't advise, but if that's how um it was meant to be then go for it but whatever is happening and transpiring i see new love is going to be coming in and i see whoever starts a new relationship at this time it's not going to be as it was in the past you're going to be starting an honest to goodness uh, coming from a true place where you're healing yourself Whoever this new man is that is coming in and transpiring, I see you're going to be accepting this offer of love and realizing that um, whoever you were given your love to wasn't deserving of your love. And you're going to be just dismissing this person and just start and move on with this person. Now, whoever this new person is, I see... Um, this person is going to be just, you, it's going to feel good. It's really going to feel good. It's someone who, um, knows exactly what you want, knows what it is that you're looking for. And this person is going to be 
really creating a lot of wonderful possibilities for you. So whoever decides to get in a relationship with this person, it is going to be very, very good. What we're seeing is that uh, some of you are going to be finding out uh, that an Aries has um, been cheating on you. This Aries has been seeing other people. So whoever is in a re relationship with an Aries, you're going to be finding out that this Aries was having some sort of a secret affair that you weren't aware of. Uh, and you are going to be clipping it and you're going to be realizing that this Aries has not been honest to you and you're going to be um, kind of creating some sort of a way um, to show this person up. So it's as if you're going to be thinking, you know, you have not been really honest to me. So guess what? I love myself. You're, you're playing your game. I can play the game too. And I see that this is how you're going to be dealing with a lot of situation that is going to be coming up. Then we see the energy of new love coming in. And trust me, whoever starts a relationship um, with a new love that is going to be coming in, it is going to be a yes. It is as if the universe is um, creating connection, love connection. So if you notice karma is there, whoever is meeting someone new, it was meant to be. Whoever this new person is that is coming in, it was meant to be. So Whoever you are, that is, uh, um, um, is, 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 you know, a lot of healing is coming in, um, and a lot of new people are going to be. So singles is a month to go out there and mingles is a, is a month to connect with other people because, uh, um, whoever you're looking for, whoever your heart is bleeding for, is going to be out there and is ready to connect to um, create their sort of a healing um, that is going to be coming up. So this is a really wonderful and really powerful, especially um, for people who have been going through some sort of a heartbreak, some sort of a misfortune, um, some sort of a issues that has created so many problems for some of you. You're going to be aligning yourself and realizing, you know, even though people have treated me unfairly in my relationship, I'm going to learn to understand that. I'm going to learn myself and uh, um, show people that I know who I am. So you don't have to be, um, feel as if you uh, um, you have no value because a lot of you have lost um, the value of feeling that you were good enough to be in a relationship because of someone just being very nasty and very disadvantaged and really manipulating and played on your ego. And I see you're going to be um, responding by um, clearing your energy and understanding who you are so that people treats you much better. So this is going to be absolutely amazing this month because it's about healing and it's about new love is coming in. Then we see some sort of information is uh, um, going to be coming in and uh, um, whoever this person is who is coming in is going to be offering you love. And I see take this love because you're going to be really happy. At the end of the day okay so some of you could be receiving some sort of a message from a, a cancer woman whoever this cancer woman is I see this woman wants to return to some of you men so um yeah so some sort of a message could be coming in that this cancer but this woman just want to return in your life because this woman needs some financial help so be aware of this then we see um the energy so um, the energy of some of you are going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness of our Aries. And I see you're going to be leaving this Aries and moving forward. Um, you're going to be realizing that some sort of information this, this Aries have told you was not true. Nothing was true. So however this is coming up is as if you're going to be seeing through some sort of illusions that an Aries had created in some of your world and you're going to be seeing the truth about this Aries because it's as if this Aries came in your life with a lot of BS 
and you realize that this what this Aries was saying is not true. And I see you're going to be just leaving that situation and realizing, oh, you have played yourself out, okay? So some of you are dealing with an Aries, some of you are dealing with a Cancer, and these people have come in your life in order to play you. They're playing their own games and dancing at it. So I see some of you realize that, uh, um, whoever this cancer and this Aries is, I've played her own games and danced at it. And you're realizing, too, do, bye. I have no time to, you know, regard and do this sort of a situation with you. So, um, someone is going to be coming in and is going to teach some of you to learn to love yourself, whoever this person is. They're going to be like, showing you who, your values and who you are. Um, a new offer of love is going to be here for you guys. So single people get out there, mingle. Um, this new offer of love is coming in. Some of you are going to be finding out about a cans, um, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman and the lies and the secrecy about this cancer. And it is just showing up as a cancer. I don't know who some of you were in a relationship with a cancer and I see they're finding out the lies and deceptiveness of this cancer and secrecy about this cancer is coming up. Okay. And this cancer was playing, um, you guys all along this cancer had a secret affair and you guys are going to be finding out about this. So then we see the energy of some of you could be dealing with a tor, a, a Virgo, a Virgo is going to be coming in your life. This Virgo can play you like a fiddle, but I see a Virgo coming in some of your lives. A Virgo wants a new start with you. This Virgo found out that there was some, um, it's, it's as if this Virgo, he plays you. He, this Virgo knows how to touch and play and, and touch your chords. Whoever this Virgo is and however this is transpiring, this Virgo wants to return in your life because this Virgo knows how you play their chords or how you can play their chords. So whoever this Virgo is, let me tell you something. There is some sort of a chemistry and this Virgo wants you back. So is it going to be a long relationship? Is it going to be? I don't know, but I can tell you this Virgo knows how to play your chords and um, how you play their cards, they want you back. New love is going to be coming in and I would say go for this new love. Go for this new love. Be open up to this new love. It is a yes. Be connected. Go for this new love. It is here to stay. Um, open up yourself to this new love because it's going to be such a powerful, powerful new love that is coming in. You were destined to be with this person. So, do not even second guess this person, this affair that is coming in. Don't even second guess it. It's, it's as if the universe is saying, listen, um, this is where you are and this is where you should be. This person that is coming in is the one that should be in your life. So go for it. Okay. And this is going to be powerful. Ladies and gentlemen, please leave a message. Um, let us know how your month has been going on. Um, please remember in order to see the extended, because these readings are in each individual sign of the extended, um, go and become a member. Use the blue um, icon to become a member on the channel. It is a monthly abandonment with YouTube. And um, you can see all, especially if you take the super, you see all, all the extended extras, bonus uh, things, extra information um, that comes out. I want to say to each and every one of you, go back and check out who this Cancer is and who this Aries is. Go check out their readings, okay? And this is why it is good to become a member of the channel because this is where YouTube is going, ladies and gentlemen. So... Some, uh, when you come up, some, um, at some times down the road, there is not going to be any more free readings because YouTube are going to be cutting back so that people can find their own people that they are, um, connected with in order to get the, like the extenders. So you're going to be seeing 
shift and changes that is going to be coming up. I do love you guys. Please like and share. And I am saying namaste until next time.